wanted to do a story on privateers and pirates without using the phrase ahoy there to start off, but I'm gonna try it this, this time. Okay, ahoy there, we're, darn, <laughs> we're on board the good, good brig adventure, adventure with the beer barred privateers today setting sail on Okanagan Lake. The beer barred privateers are a group dedicated to learning about the history of the days of sail by recreating and reliving them. You gotta really like the history, you gotta like the old tall ships. You want to learn a little bit about uh, nautical terms and rigging and knowing what, what you're looking at. Brian was struck by the tall ship fever early. When I was a, a kid, a little lad in Vancouver, I was down at the waterfront quite a bit. They had these uh, brig brigantines that started the Vancouver uh, Centennial and they did a bit for, for X-86 and then kind of just faded away. And I was involved with Sea Scouts a lot on the Vancouver waterfront at that time, and I just watched them and really admired them. So when I moved to the Okanagan, I thought this lake was kind of ideal. I could just vision pirates out, out there. And the history of the Okanagan, there's been so many great boat builders and class boats, you know, all along this waterfront. And then I just thought, it's a perfect fit. Inspired, Brian and his crew set out to build a small-scale replica of a sailing brig. With its distinctive rigging and miniature cannons, using the adventure attracts attention. Always. Always. We have to stop quite a bit and let people take photos of it. Um, yeah, people love it. We're usually told it's the best boat they've seen on the lake. We've had people where we fire cannons off that are eating in some of the restaurants, uh, like Rick's Grill over there, and they'll come around and tell us made their night, particularly when we're coming in towards sunset. Another thing that the Bard privateers are doing is not just recreating the ancient art of boat building, but reviving the manly art of self-defense with their rapier. On guard. I need some more practice. All ages and genders are welcome to join the privateers. Every member finds their own favorite aspect. All right, that looks pretty ferocious there. How many lessons have you guys had? Two. Two. Oh, okay. <laughs> but uh, but you're, you're into this whole pirate thing. This is exciting. Oh, yeah. yeah. And the, the boat. Love it. And the costumes. I to learn how to sing. So I can't sing. <laughs> yeah, you shouldn't say that to me unless you're going to sing. You get no, no sh shanty? Can we? Oh, we, oh, we got the song. Okay, we got the song. We got the song book. We'll do a shanty. Oh, let's see the sh sea shanty official sea shanty book. Hey, hey, hey blow them down. down. Well, you get the idea. Perhaps I should stick to firing the really cool cannons. They produce a satisfying bang and a, a nice flash. Use carbide and water. A technique right. borrowed from turn of the century children's toys. Well, that's quite an adventure, and shooting cannons is something you've got to try at least once in your life. If you want to find out more about beer-barred privateers, visit their website.